um, it doesn't really matter whether the training is military, even if it was supposed to be an ordinary security training, to a foreign national who originate from a country where there is armed conflict, that is illegal. So we are going to prefer criminal charges against the owners. It's quite obvious we've already made a pronouncement that they've committed a criminal offence. The owners, we have already announced that as of this morning we've served them with such suspensions. Um, so the owner and the, uh, the camp itself, the, the registered one, remember we get involved because we have accredited uh, MDSS. The suspension that we announced this morning is regarding the registered camp because the very actions that we are dealing with now arose out of uh, their, you know, their activities. Uh, although I must say for the purposes of this investigation, uh, we are talking about two different camps. There is one that is registered, there is one that is not registered. The people who are linked to the one that is registered are the ones who are involved in the running of the camp that is illegal. Therefore, we will have to suspend their license because that's not what we, we registered them for or accredited them to do.